Hi, I'm PJ Ju and I'm sharing some info on how I attached my USB water faucet, 11 bucks on Amazon, to a three and a half gallon Reliance jug. The, the blue jugs with the black big old cap and a spout. Removed the spout and figured out a way with some PVC fittings to put the uh, faucet on top. So check it out, hope it helps. Here's the cap for the jug. Here is a male adapter, they're calling it. Three quarter inch, threaded on one side. And uh, I think it it's a reducer, so it's half inch on this side. So that just goes right in. I put some plumber's tape there. It screws in pretty nice. I've always had issues and other people have too, even though I've put plumber's tape here and on inside uh, the threads for the big cap. Always have issues with it leaking when it's on its side and I do not want to rust out my car. So I'm glad I have this cool USB faucet that lets me keep it all upright so water cannot fall out. Now, second aspect, here's my faucet. Super easy, just press the button and it pumps. I will add a silicone tubing right in there. But as you see, I put a whole bunch of uh, plumber's tape inside there. Basically because this fits into that half inch coupling very easily and very loosely. But I wanted to have a bit of um, a firm connection so it's not rattling around. So I just fattened it up by putting rounds and rounds of plumber's tape in sort of a cork shape uh, so that it would go on easier meaning it's thinner towards the side where this towards the bottom where the tubing goes in and then thicker as it gets towards the the top of this and this just goes straight in like this and now stuck on pretty good does not need to be a permanent fixture so I do like the idea of moving this around. And now I'll just stick that silicone tube in and it'll work nice. And this will just screw right on top of the jug. Oh, I got the silicone tube in there. It's quite long because I wasn't sure about where I wanted to place this. It's been in different places. But we'll just keep it long for now in case we want to change it. Guy okay, screws right back on. Now it doesn't have to be ridiculously tight because it won't be on its side and leak all over the place. Let's see how it fits in. Goes like that. Put it around like that. I'm gonna tighten that up a little more. In my hand, let's use this. Woo. <laughs> Yay! Simple. I, before I was trying to attach it to here, or attach it up there, it would take up too much space, and I love this huge desk, so I'm glad it kind of just sits on its own.